The countryside around Wells is great for growing apples. And you can visit farms that brew the authentic hard cider, known around here as Scrumpy. While cider is becoming more and more refined and popular, the traditional Scrumpy still attracts a devoted crowd, especially here in Somerset. And at Land's End Cider Farm, Roger Wilkins is as old school as it comes. His enthusiasm alone is intoxicating. Did your father make this same, same cider? My father did, but actually I learned it off my grandfather. Yeah. The actual making of the cider is exactly the same now as, as my grandfather done it. All we do is crush them up, press the apples, the natural juice comes out, and the yeast is in the skin of the apple, so I don't put nothing at all in it. Uh, it's the purest drink you'll get. We head into the tasting room, which I'm guessing looks about the same as it did when Roger's grandfather ran the place. It's time to sample the pure apple taste of Scrumpy, along with its 6.8 alcohol content. I've heard when you drink Scrumpy, you've got to be careful. Well, yeah, it can knock you about if you ain't used to it. But gallon a day, you keep the doctor away. I've heard some, <laughs> I've heard some pubs actually don't serve it because No, it, no, they won't. Some, if what, you what, go what, in now, they'll serve you a half a pint. Right? And it's pure, 20. so it's so um, pure that in the morning, no problem. No problem at all, no headaches, yeah. no hangovers, no, nothing. That may be true, but after my tasting, I'm making sure my producer does the driving. 